Hey, it's that guy here. Uh, today I'm going to do a pocket dump. I uh, was watching Singing Toad's EDC pocket dump and it was an open tag. And this is one of those open tags that has gone around YouTube forever, probably. But I don't think I've ever done one. So I figured I'd do a little bit of a pocket dump. Now, uh, this is, what, June of 2023? So, uh, to start off with, I normally have in my pocket, if I'm staying around Oklahoma City where I live, um, I have my Buck 110 Pro. Uh, it's a S30V Steel. Uh, Micarta Scales. Nice deep carry pocket clip. I normally have this if I'm going somewhere else that I'm not sure about the knife laws and this has got almost a four inch blade on it. I will carry instead my Buck 112. Basically same knife, just shorter blade. And actually sometimes I carry this and this is kind of one of my favorite knives. And sometimes I'll just carry this because I feel like carrying it. And I'll swap it out with this. And I'll just put these over here. And then I always have my mini champ. Normally I have my uh, 110 or 112 clip to my right pocket and in the right pocket or the watch pocket if I if I'm wearing jeans or a pair of pants with the watch pocket I'll have my it's a 58 millimeter I put titanium scales on it um, mini champ is like my favorite Swiss Army knife and then in the same pocket I'll have there we go dropping everything I have a little mini Bic just never know when you need to light something. And I also normally have, get everything back into the camera here, my bullet pen. It's a Fisher bullet pen. This one I've had for years. And it's just when you need to mark something, uh, write a note my next thing will be for that I carry a little write in the rain notebook it, uh, this one's about half used got information in there I feel I need or want or shopping list and so on and uh, it's just a handy little notebook to carry sometimes I'll carry this in my left pocket with my wallet um, if I have a shirt pocket, I'll carry that in my shirt pocket. Now, along with the pen, some most of the time I'll be carrying this, but if I do have a shirt pocket, I'll be carrying a small pen like this. Uh, I picked this up at the flea market down in New Orleans. It's got a little dragons on it. It's just a little, about three inch pen. And for me to jot stuff down, that's all you really need. But take that knife over, put that knife over here. This stuff is what I'm carrying all the time. I also have a coil of 550 cord in my right pocket. Um, just never know when you need some cordage, you know, and I've used this quite often just to tie up a bundle of stuff to carry or tie something down in the vehicle uh, keep it from rolling around and so on now over in my left pocket I have my wallet uh, this is what is this make I don't think it's on here believe it um, it's just a neat little canvas wallet I think it's made by rainbow I've had it forever um, carry some band-aids in here in this little pocket over here I carry extra cash 
uh, normally carry about fifty dollars in there call it my emergency money in the little zip pocket um, I have yeah that opened up I have my little p38 there that way I always have a little uh, can open up a can or use this as a pry bar small pry bar flathead screwdriver can use the corners on uh, Phillips head so just handy little tool there I throw that in my wallet uh, I this pocket you can also carry some ID cards and whatnot in the front I carry my driver's license over the other side it's normally my ID card or my driver's license and ID card one of the two plus I got you know library card Costco other stuff and uh, my daily cash I just carry here in the front I normally only carry a couple bucks but uh, you know debit cards and everything are in my wallet and this is normally in my left pocket front pocket here um, along with I've got my pen light it's uh, uses a single triple-a battery that's in my left pocket that's in my right front pocket this left front pocket and then uh, depending on what I'm doing I'll either have uh, one of my larger Swiss Army knives or you know I could be carrying my uh, uh, tr a traditional folder again it just depends on what I'm doing sometimes I'll if I'm gonna be going out whittling I've got a little mini champ and this is my uh, recruit Swiss Army got a blade on there it's modified for whittling so if I'm gonna be doing that you know it depends on where I'm going what I'm doing what I throw in that left pocket the knife over there right now it's the uh, um, Evo 18 um, the S18 has a locking blade on it I don't care for that so I've got the Evo 18 there's no locking blade on it and it's just to have a it's got scissors and can opener screwdriver all that stuff wood saw again just depends on what I'm doing as to what knife I'm gonna be dragging out with me but on normal day-to-day -day, this is what I've got up here now in my back pocket pretty much all I ever carry in my back pocket is my bandana and sometimes my cell phone normally my cell phones in my back pocket depending on the pants I'm wearing just because it won't fit in the front pockets and then for a watch I've got a uh, it's an Android or Samsung um, Gen 2 watch version 2 it's a uh, waterproof I've had it four or five years uh, main reason I wear this is uh, not only time but I keep track of my steps and also if I get a text message or phone call on my phone especially when I'm at work uh, I can see if it's uh, something I need to take care of right now or just wait and I'm not pulling out my phone I work at the ballpark and yeah they don't like you to be on your phone so if I see that there's a phone call I need to to get I can let uh, people know hey I need to step away for a couple minutes and take care of this it's important and if it's not I just let go voicemail text message I wait till I'm on my break to answer and that's my pocket dump it's a uh, like I said these are my standard things that I carry on a day-to-day -day. and then this stuff is dependent on where I'm at what I'm doing uh, I'll carry these uh, this a lot of times will get replaced if I'm carrying one of these but uh, that's it if you have any questions or comments please leave them below and remember always be prepared